So I apologize ahead of time. I didn't want to have to make this video. I was just listening to this show here on Matt Barr and working on my script. And then I hear this on here. So this isn't the first time that this guy has done this. This is the second time now. The first time that DG did this, he was telling people that me, Hervé, and Risey were in a discord uh, doing something to him. Hervé is not in Risey's discord. He's not in there. That's just a fact. And secondly, if, if you think Risey could do any sort of an op, there's no way that would happen. When he gets drunk, he would just be blurting it out. It's just, it's just what it is there. So now I'm watching this, and apparently, according to DG on here, I'm whispering in Liam's ear, telling him what, what I don't know. So I'll be, I'll be uh, transparent here. Uh, the only conversation that I can think of that I've ever had with Liam about DG at all was him complaining to me or explaining to me, I should say, about what happened or whatever. And I just said to him, I told you about this guy, which I, I, I have no problem being transparent there. I told him about this guy. I warned him. That's all I said. And that was in a Discord a long time ago, and I explained to him what what I just told you about him saying that we're planning against him in a discord with Irving. That was it. Um, I have no personal issue with Liam. Okay? I understand that DG and Matt Barr do, but why I keep getting dragged into this, I don't understand. I had to do this with Matt Barr a week or two ago when Liam efapped my video and then Matt Barr was giving me shit on that and I just explained to him. I said, look, the guy efapped my video. He asked me, he, he told me he was doing it. You know, I want my video shared. I don't care who watches them. I'm fine with it being shared. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to say, no, Liam, don't do it after the fact? Matt Barr was very understanding and gracious with me. He was very polite. He said, okay, Roger that. I understand that the guy shared your video. That was it. So now I have this again. This is the second time this guy has done this to me. Um, I don't know what his issue with me is other than I'm friends with Rising and Shep. Um, I don't get on these streams and scream about DG and argue with him for hours. I could give a fuck. I, 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 I know Rising and Shepard. I just don't care about DG. And I'm watching this, and then I, I hear this on here. Well, I'll tell you one thing. If you have to choose between uh, who you should listen to, and the choices are me and DG... Um, okay, let's look at it logically. Uh, DG is a bartender. He doesn't have a business degree. I don't think he does. Um, he's trying to make a comic. As far as I know, the book is late. I Don't quote me on that. I, that's, this is just what I heard. It could be bullshit. That isn't true. I don't know. That's, that's as much as I know about DG. Oh, and he does his music streams and all that stuff. Okay, that's, that's what I know. Now, me, on the other hand, have business degrees. I've worked in multi-million dollar companies. Uh, I am retired. So, you tell me who would be the more logical person to listen to here. A bartender who likes drama with comic books or a retired defense contractor with a business degree and has HR people he can access and have conversations with this about. You tell me. If I'm wrong, so be it. You know? Hey, that's all I can tell you there. 
Um, I don't give, I don't advise Liam anything. I don't tell Liam to do anything. Um, I don't have a problem with Liam. I know they do, but I, what, I'm supposed to go hate Liam because these two people that I never talked to hate Liam? I'm not, I'm not getting involved in this. I keep getting dragged into this for some reason. And yes, I'm friends with Risey and Shep, and I would probably even say I'm friendly with Liam. I'm like, I, I don't talk to Liam enough to even call him a friend or anything. You know, I see him on there and stuff. I'm not, Liam is not my enemy. He's done nothing to me. But I'm not going to go get involved with a disagreement with Matt Barr has with him or DG because that has nothing to do with me. See, I have I have enough having to deal with Risey and George with this. I'm getting really tired of this. Why, why is everybody always complaining to me and doing this shit? It's like these Sheila alien simps and these fucking losers crying to me and this this fucking bartender's on here doing this. You know, it's like, the fuck, man? But as far as advice has gone and giving Liam any, I, I can't even think of something I've said to him in the brief convos that I've had with him. You know, there's no... These people, I just... All right, here we go. But I'm not. In, I'm not sincere. I, I. I. have ulterior motives. That's fucking war campaign and Risey and fucking Hargrave and all those guys talking in your ear, pal. Like I said, full transparency. That's the only thing that I've told Liam about was he said that me, Risey, and Hervé were planning whatever in the discord that's what he was telling people wasn't true then and neither is this um you know i find it interesting how when him and risey were fighting on there that he says he doesn't think about us or anything and they're not doing any of this and then i turn this on and i'm not expecting anything i'm just writing my script and then i hear it that i'm whispering to liam doing this are you kidding me? Really? Hey. If I was to give Liam like real advice, I would just tell him to focus on his comics and do more fun streams like where he's driving and stuff. That's, that's the open ad advice that I would give him. And as far as DG's concerned, I, I'll be honest, I did warn him a while ago about that. It's not like I'm sitting here daily whispering to him going, don't do this, DG's going to get you, don't do this, da, 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 da. you know, it's like, for fuck's sake, man. I tried typing, typing in the chat, they just ignored it here, you know, because they want to go with their narrative and all this, so. Oh, well, I gave you receipts here, so you can say what you want. I, I have full transparency. You can message me and ask me, and Liam will probably do a video himself and tell you. You know? Like I said, that's, that's what I told him a long time ago, that this is what this guy does. He goes on the chats, and he creates drama and does all this, just like this here. You know? I can't even remember the last time... I even talked to DG, and and here I am. I'm telling Liam to, to do to do whatever. And by the way, you know, nobody. I know DG hasn't figured this out yet. No, nobody can tell Liam what to do. You can't. Even if I wanted to tell him, he's not going to do do it. You know, he just does his own thing. I mean, yeah, you know, he might listen or take your advice under consideration, but he's just going to go do whatever the fuck he wants. So I know 
Dark Gift is in a heated fight with my co-host. And now I'm being dragged into this when I didn't even say anything or do anything to him. Uh, th this is the most that I've been concerned or said anything or even been involved with this guy. So there you go. You got receipts. I got him right there saying it. I wish I had the other time when he said we were planning ops. See, these people just, it's literally the view all the time. Just a bunch of chickens cackling. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.